All right, welcome back. Are you ready for this word? Genderqueer. Haven't heard that word, uh, I don't know, ever, or in a while anyway. <laughs> I, I don't know. This is great so far. This is, one of those, this is one of those blocks where you know I'm just out of my complete element. Uh, I am joined now by Jeffrey Marsh, LGBTQ activist and author of the new book, How to Be You. Um, okay. So, can, I, can uh, I say I'm honored? Honored to be here. Oh, I appreciate that. And I, I respect you. If you're out of your element, that is that. I'm, discuss. I'm completely out of my element. I'll tell you why I'm out of my element. I'm out tell of me. my element um, because a, I don't understand why a guy. Um, mm -hmm. I always want to make sure I say the right thing because I don't want to insult anybody. But uh, I'm why a guy I'm would want to wear? Uh, insult. All right. It's okay. Um, you know, sort of dressing a bit like a woman and you got makeup on like a woman and yet you got a scruff um, mm -hmm. I, you know I think my audience and myself are a bit confused so and the other thing too is that and you yes. can comment on all this stuff um, I hear gender queer and you know if I were to say the word queer mm -hmm. like if you walked out and I said what a queer and I was caught and it was put out there people would be calling for my job but yet you can say gender queer. So, go ahead. You got the next two minutes to explain to me what it is that I'm not understanding. <laughs> Who am I? Why is this so confusing? Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. I do not identify as either a man or a woman, which is something we can talk about at length. But it's as far as the appropriation of the word queer. I think it's necessary sometimes for certain minority groups to re-own what they have been negatively called. And there are other words for it. You can say gender fluid. Well, and you're going you're to attack me with too many things here because my brain Sorry. can only, I, I mean, you know. We'll do one at a yeah, time. Yeah, you know what, if you tell me. How about neither man nor about woman? It, yeah, yeah, let's go with that <laughs> one because that one, I think you sort That's of threw me off the start. planet on that one. So if you don't identify as a man or a woman, what exactly are you? That's a great question. And I hope that I never find out. Meaning, sometimes I feel like butch, ready to go, guy, that's the scruff. Sometimes I feel more feminine, artistic, stuff that is considered in this culture to be womanly. I float in this space in between, and I always have. Finding the word for it has given me the freedom to truly be myself. Can I ask you a couple of personal questions? I know it's totally like a foreign language. Am I allowed to ask some personal questions? Absolutely, please. Uh, your parents. Yes. Together or divorced? Together. My mother is a pastor. Okay. So when uh, when did this all start happening? Like where you started wearing <laughs> makeup, wearing makeup and wearing women's clothes? Oh, well, wearing makeup was about, gosh, third grade. Started wearing my mom's clothes. Well, what, what did your dad say? At first, as you might imagine, both parents had a negative reaction. I told mom, my, so my relationship with dad was always strained. I told mom when I was 11 years old. Mm -hmm. She was driving at the time. But what did you tell her? You, I don't know what I am? Well, at the time, all I could get to come out, this was, I was born in the late 70s. So okay. it gives you an idea of the time frame we're talking about. Okay. So around late 80s, right? I tell my mom, she doesn't have context for it, neither do I. All I can get to come out at the time is, I think I like boys. Okay. And I discovered that actually the story was much more complicated than that. Okay, so so let, let's I, I got to take this in pieces, man. Yes. So so, Person. so 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 you like boys? Do you, you still said, like? Do you, you still said like? I have to take it in pieces, man. Yeah. Person. Person. Okay. It's a whole new world, Dennis. Yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> I, 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 this may be one of those worlds. And no, no I, you don't, don't have understand. to join me. It's you sort of like to trying to me. ask me to do calculus. I'm never going to do it, and I don't know if I really should put a lot of time in learning calculus. That's uh, how I feel about running in flat shoes. Don't ask me to do it. Okay, so, so, I, 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 do you still have uh, your manhood? Uh, you want to talk about my genitals? Yeah. Yeah, I have a penis. Okay, so, so totally fine talking about that. Okay, so so you still it's have that. So you haven't gone through any sort of transgender transformation nope. with an operation. Okay, gender fluid, gender queer, they're considered separate okay. from transgender. So, uh, oh boy, we're running out of time. If if, <laughs> if when, what gets you um, 
excited? Is it when you see a pretty woman or a pretty man? It's honestly when I see a good-looking person that I connect to spiritually. I'm currently with a partner who happens to identify as a man. We've been together for six years. Okay. But that doesn't preclude the fact that maybe tomorrow you would want to be with a woman. Uh, I've never really been attracted to people who identify solely as women. So why not just identify yourself as a gay man? Because I realize that there's more to my gender story. All right, so I, you know, we don't have a lot of time left, yeah. so I'm going to give you 30 seconds right now to tell my audience why it is that they should get this book. See, see, see that clock? When that gets to 10, your time's up. Okay, <laughs> go. Because I am a metaphor. Who I am as a human being is a metaphor for you. Every single person on earth was told at one point or another, there's something wrong with you. And the message here is, there's nothing wrong with you. How to be you involves accepting, loving, and discovering who you are. So if somebody gets that book, are they going to have a better understanding on people like yourself? That's part of the story in the book. What they'll have a better understanding of is themselves. All right, how to be you. I appreciate your time. Thanks so much. We'll Thanks. be back.